So we got the Phillies versus Yankees. We got the Sixers versus the Knicks. And we finally got the Philly cheesesteak versus the New York City chopped Chop cheese. Woo! New York's better. It's better. Because you live here? Is because that why? <laughs> I live here. <laughs> Philly stinks. You got the cracked Liberty Bell and that's it. There's nothing about Philly that's great. Maybe the cheesesteak is good, but... Probably cheesesteak is probably the best thing to come out of Philly. It's like so true. ever. That and Allen Iverson. Allen Iverson. Is never he... won a championship. No, but he is the best <laughs> basketball player Philly had. He stayed in Philly. Andre Iguodala was supposed to be it, but guess what? He's now a part of the Warriors winning rings. So what are you going to do about that, Philly? <laughs> but I, I do love the Philly cheesesteak. So the Philly cheesesteak is much more well-known compared to the chopped cheese. Nobody knows what chopped cheese is outside of New York City. It's just not like a thing people have. I I think the chopped cheese was created to uh, rival the Philly cheesesteak, honestly. It's, it's yeah. basically like a basic Philly cheesesteak, but with like hamburger meat. Basically a long burger. Compared to a Philly cheesesteak, you got basically- Ribeye. Yes, yeah, sliced ribeye, cheese. cheese. Everyone knows what a Philly cheesesteak is. I don't have to explain to you what it is. I'm sure you've had one sometime in your life. We're gonna see which one's better today. That's right. Which one should we start with? I'm gonna give Philly the honors and start with Philly because you always end with New York. It's just a better sandwich. Is that blasphemous to put mayo on your Philly cheesesteak? Not nah, my world. <laughs> so we got Philly cheesesteak from a place called Shorty's. Obviously we didn't go all the way to Philly. We don't have the budget for that or the time. Listen, it's a recession. If you think that we're going to be driving all the way to Philadelphia for a cheesesteak that costs 20 bucks and pay, what, $5 in gas per gallon, you're out of your mind. Now, you just lather on everything. like you... Hot sauce and mayo. If you did this in Philly, I feel like someone would smack you in the face. That's why I don't go to Philly. <laughs> Philly cheesesteak, let's do it. That tastes like a classic Philly cheesesteak. It's really good. The bread is so fluffy, I love it. The meat is solid. They put a perfect amount of cheese. The onions and peppers are amazing. I think they use sweet peppers. Nearly every Philly cheesesteak place that I go to has really soft, amazing bread. Mm -hmm. And it just goes so well with everything else that's in it mm -hmm. because it all just kind of gels together with the cheese, the meat, the vegetables. Shorties. You guys ready for this? All right, you're right, John Kim. I'm ready. All right. I'm giving my score as seven and a half. Very strong seven and a half. I don't think it quite meets the 8.0 and for a couple of reasons. One, I think the quality of meat is fine. It's not amazing. It's not mind blowing. And I also do think that you could use a little bit more cheese melted on top. Um, but overall, it's a really solid sandwich. I'd eat this any day of the week. Uh, seven and a half for me. Strong seven and a half. Personally, I'm going to give it a eight. I think it's good. I think it's a very good sandwich. However, I've been to Philly, I've had cheesesteaks there, it's definitely better there. Mm -hmm. But for New York City cheesesteak, I ain't complaining about this. And also this is like, for a cheesesteak, usually Philly cheesesteaks are bigger. Like yeah. this is a pretty small Philly cheesesteak, mm -hmm. especially for 12 bucks. That was a Philly cheesesteak. It's time for the chopped cheese now. You ready? I'm ready. Let's do it. This is from Haji's Chopped Cheese. These are the original chopped cheese of New York City. These are the guys that created it. This is the deli you get it from. And the crazy thing about this deli is most people don't do this, but they panini press the sandwich. Is there like a rule of getting chopped cheese where like the crappier the bodega is, the better it's gonna taste or something like that? Not necessarily. The thing is you have to look to see who's behind the counter. If it's not Hispanic, walk away. Cause they don't know what the f they're doing. <laughs> All right, we got our chopped cheese, ready? Let's do it. Let's do it. Oh, I'm liking this. This a is lot. so good. I always use a little bit more meat, but this is so good. The American cheese in here is just like so flavorful. Mm -hmm. Like you taste the lettuce, you taste the tomato, you taste the onion, and everything tastes so fresh. And just it's just amazing. You have your score? I do have my score. 9.0. Woo! That is a high score. That's a high score. It's a That's strong a high score. 9.0. Haji's Blue Deli, Blue Sky Deli. You win my heart yet again. Damn. That's a super high score. Mm -hmm. I'm going to give it an 8.5. I figured you would. 8.5. Just because 
it is better than Philly cheesesteak. Just slightly though. I do like the bread on the Philly cheesesteak a little bit more, but the inside of this... Chopped cheese? Tastes better. Oh, so good. You know what it feels like? It feels like they never clean their grill. It's all the flavor of all those chopped cheese years on that grill in here. So like, good. I taste the experience mm -hmm. in here. And that's not usually a good thing when it comes to food, but, mm -hmm. but when it comes to this, oh my God. Today, New York City wins. New York City beats New York City Philly cheesesteak. <laughs> I'm surprised that this hasn't like taken off at other places. It's amazing. We need more chopped cheese places. Someone open so one up. It's like New York City is like hogging it. They're like a ball hog. <laughs> they just, they don't, they don't want to let it go. They They're, don't want to share. Yeah, it. they don't want to share. New York City doesn't want to share this amazing treasure they have. Guess what? I'm okay with that. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe as always. All right. Thank you guys. Appreciate it. We out. Peace. Peace. Anything you want to add? New York's better than Philly. That's it. That's all I got to add. I'm going to add to Philly. I'm sorry. Can I do that? <laughs> Can I do that? I'm just doing it anyways. We're gonna, I'm going to like do like targeting advertisements for Philadelphia for this episode. <laughs>